and I am going to co-create. Oh, I find it already. Or oh, I found it already. <laughs> I find it already. <laughs> Caribbean English. The world is ready for you. It's your time to probably. shine. Probably, most probably. We've been waiting. I just need to be ready for the world. Yeah. yeah. Well, no, you are. I am. Don't growl. That's like a bit scary. Don't do that. I'm gonna continue doing my content. I'm gonna get my YouTube channel monetized this year and. Let me just say this. When you see me running around in these streets and I'm organized, I got my life together, I'm a content queen, queen of consistency, all of that good stuff, just know it's her. I have a lot to learn. It's not to learn, it's just to do. Hi beautiful people, welcome back to a new vlog on my channel. My name is Sujin Yanga and this is a new vlog. We're ending the month of April on a high note and I'm now going to get up and get ready because today I'm headed to Rotterdam, Rotterdam. I'm going to Rotterdam and I am going to co-create with another creative and I'm so looking forward to it because we are co-creating. We are creating together and seeing how we can continue. I have a lot of nice plans for this weekend, so I thought I would take you along, show you what I'm doing to end the month, because I started this month and I had a vlog I put out. If you didn't watch it, I will pop up and it will be down in the description box down below. So, yeah, let's go. My run outside was nice, fast. I didn't go too far, run a bit longer in some places I normally don't run, so. Yeah, feeling good. Hi, beautiful people. I'm here, I'm done. I'm actually dressed and everything. Oh my gosh, it's all good. They better be. <laughs> but yeah, okay, I think they are. What do you think of my head wrap? Leave a thumbs up for the head wrap. Eee, I love it. I got it from, I don't know how to say her name. I never said it now that I think about it. I know it's Chapo Agency and Defo. Defo? Dufo. I'm going to put the name up here. I've supported her for years. I have a few things from her. And when I saw this, I had to get it. And one subscriber, I think she knew me from my videos. She she was so kind. She was so kind enough to actually get one for me. And also one from Coco Lishi, the one that I have over here. The one with like the old gilder sign. She was so kind to actually go and get them for me in Curacao. And give them to my aunt for me, which is so kind. So if you're watching, thank you so much. I'm so happy to have them. I have them since last year. And I wore it as like a top and as like a cover up for the beach. I should leave. I need to leave the house. I'm going to leave the house and talk to you when I'm by the train station or the tram station because I'm a bit late. In the streets of Rotterdam at Goalhaven. Uh, and look how beautiful. So pretty. So pretty. So pretty, so pretty, so pretty. I'm waiting for my co-creator because I told her I was going to arrive a bit later, but I eventually in the end actually took the same tram at the same time that I was expecting. So we're now going to walk to the place, see if we can find it, and then oh I find it already. Or I found it already. <laughs> I find it already. <laughs> Caribbean English. Oh that's not into the water side. And wait for her a bit. I think right around here is where one of my friends live and I celebrated a new year here that new year was uh, too much but yeah it is I think in the same street we went up and she lives somewhere here oh my god it's so windy I hope you can still see me good but okay yeah that new year here too much Prosecco yeah yeah Yeah, she used to. She doesn't live here anymore. I think it's best if I just go inside and have a coffee already. Because I haven't had breakfasts as yet. 
as well. So. And someone gave me a compliment in the tram. I think she was Hispanic or, yeah, she was Latin for sure. And she said it in Spanish. Yeah, here is exactly where I spent the new year. On that bridge, we brought in the new year. And I walked in my heels all cute and happy new year. After that, black. Anyway, we're not there no more. Well, I think I'm just going to go to the place and sit down and get a coffee because I'm hungry. I'm hungry. But yeah, the person that's, that I looked cute. Aw, she's so beautiful. She was like, was like, oh, thank you. Anyway, let's go to this place now. It's called Culture Hub. And yeah, it's supposed to be a vibe. So let's check it out. Hi. Hmm? Ja, ik wil gewoon ergens zitten. Mag dat me nou? Natuurlijk dat ik er zitten zou ik zeggen. Ja. Uh, ja, ik wacht wel op iemand. Ze komt zo meteen. Dank je wel. Hi doggy. Dit is Luna. Luna? Ja. Ah, cute name. Hi Luna. I don't like dogs, but this one seems friendly. <laughs> A few moments later. Say hi. Is hi. your eng? Mmm. Mmm. Wait, I wish myself though. <laughs> I love this, I want it. Mm. Mm. <laughs> Who's that beautiful lady? This is like a, it's a GoPro. Yeah. I'm co-creating today with this beautiful lady. Yeah. She see. is. Oh my God, I'm such a, you have to put a new sound. Explain, who are you? Oh God, no. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not ready for that. The world is, I am not ready for the world. The I, world is ready for you. It's your time to probably, shine. Probably, most probably. We've been waiting. I just need to be ready for the world. Yeah. yeah. Well, no, you are. I am. Yeah. Just, yeah. Anyway, let's cheers, let's cheers. Cheers. Or coffee. Hi, doggy. Okay. Do you have a dog? Hi, doggy. Oh, don't growl. That's like a bit scary. I'm gonna do that. Hi. What do you, oh, you want someone to like pull it? Oh no, oh. I can't pull it. Mm -mm. Oh, that that's kind bit... of game. I don't mind that kind of game. <laughs> that's a bit too rough for us. That's a little too rough. Yeah. We're not so rough. Should we walk it up? Look at this producer. She produced great big things. Huh? <laughs> you never no, no, no. Wait, wait, wait. Do it like this, like you did before. Okay. So film yourself. Yeah. And then leave some negative space for me to appear. Okay. But then I. Like... Wait, so you're like, you're, you're, hey people, hi people, how are you? How are you? And then uh -huh. you say, and here's and then her, here. and then boom. Okay, hi okay. people, here I am, take two, uh-huh, uh-huh, boom. Effortless. Oh, I love him! I love you! I love the him. bridge is open, and the boat is passing. Oh, I yeah. smell the ocean. Yeah. I need to make some posts. Like a like a yodeling thing. But it's yodeling who? The... You. <laughs> <laughs> you. Know, but like from afar, from really like, no, do this. You. And then the other shot is like really. You. Because you know? <laughs> I've learned mm -hmm. to sing these things. Like. Greetings. Sing. No, this is it. This is it. Sit again. Hoi hoi. Hallo, hallo. You. <laughs> <laughs> This is another place we wanted to come to today, but we didn't. But I think you should definitely check it out. Kula. No worries, it's Kula. Oh, no worries, it's Kula. Ah, I get it. Just go with the flow. <laughs> I like it. Look. Kula. It's a vibe.
I'm home now. Oh, my nose is like stiffy, be um, stiffy, sniffy because allergies. I walked it all the way from Kohlhafe in Rotterdam to Stotthuis. I was going to Black to look for some flowers, but the market was closed and it wasn't too cold outside. And it wasn't too warm, so I thought, why not walk? And today was such a good day. The lady that I met today was actually one of my old classmates and we reconnected last year. While we were going to school, we almost never hung out. I don't think ever. We worked on projects together. Now and then, we never really connected. And now, almost five years later, we reconnected and we're cooperating together. It's so nice. So today we met up and we, we kind of first built a relationship to see how we do with each other and just talking, connecting, and we connect on a lot of things. Today we met up to co-create, that's what I'm calling it now. Whenever I meet someone or spend time with someone that's also like a influencer or content creator or producer, we're co-creating. So that's what we did today. And it went so well, like, we had a good time just talking, sharing ideas, talking about our strategies, concepts, plans, where we should go. And it was just good to have that kind of like sparring partner. So that was amazing. It was a good time. And the place that we went to was so beautiful. Perfect location just to go and have a drink. Their sandwich was amazing. Hummus with avocado, tomato, rucola. Really perfect combination and the coffee was amazing there was a dog there oh my god luna i'm kind of dog person can you imagine me for people that know me me liking dogs i got bitten on my head by a dog and i'm liking dogs that dog loved me that dog as soon as it i, I got in it came running to me with the little like pull thing because it's kind of like one of those like family to pit bull dogs and he, he, the owner told me the name but i forgot stout 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 whatever and that's besides the point so the dog came running to me and trying to to like get me to play with it and was really happy and I was like oh my god I think in the video you'll probably see me like eh, eh, eh. I sat down and the dog came and just sat next to me just like sat and just stood it would go to other people and come back to me that is that that's that's incredible but I think for now I just need to relax because I now do feel that yeah today was a long day a lot of energy I'm finally having breakfast. Eggs and um, bread. I ate the other one, it's gone. <laughs> but I'm having egg with uh, mayo, salt, and pepper. Some grapes and coffee with some brown sugar and oat milk. Really yummy. I'm going to watch Grace and Frankie. I was tired after having a full day yesterday, a lot of energy, a lot of like brainstorming. So yeah, it was good though. It was good, so I can't complain. But I was tired and I woke up today and I need to edit a video that I want to put online for today. But I'm not feeling how I felt when I made the video. So I don't know if I should post it, but I think because of that, I should post it. Yeah, and I want to film another video as well today so I can have that to edit and also get up on my YouTube channel soon. I'll get back to you when I'm all dressed and ready and filmed the new video. It's gonna be nice. I have excitement around it, so I'll see you then. I'm outside. I made some content. Oh, if you haven't, I hope I have moment right. I think I do. If you haven't seen on Instagram my post, I got these earrings. I got these earrings from Lovelies by Lulu. So I got them from her, the abundant hoops, and they are so lightweight. They're one of the easiest hoops that I've had this size ever. And I've had like quite a lot of hoops. They're so lightweight, they're perfect. And they have an amazing detail here with like just that little cute um like pastel light green diamond i find it so nice one of my favorite hoops at the moment if you haven't already i'll put her 
Instagram link down below that you can go and check her out and make a purchase. She also has a lot of other beautiful things and she is a Curso creative and yeah she's a Curso creative yeah <laughs> so go and check her out she has a lot of nice things a lot of good things especially like for um manifesting and uplifting and inspiring so yeah I'm now just outside enjoying some sun. I took a lot of pictures. I'm gonna show you. Oh, where are you going? I took a lot of pictures and my phone kept on being full, so I had to stop a few times. Uh, wait, let me. I think I have mainly the pictures I took now on my phone. Wait, I don't know if you're going to see it all good, but all of that is what I took today. And it's mainly pictures and. Uh, videos of how to head wrap your hair it's one of my best videos on my youtube channel that i made a few years ago and like especially like around this time and especially i have braids in i love to style my hair with head wraps and i did use a few things or actually two scarves from two creatives again from curacao there's a lot of creatives from curacao that have products and their own businesses yeah, i like to support them and get their things and just uh yeah get them because they're really beautiful they're from the island they're made well i did that for the majority of the afternoon and i'm now outside because i sent a package that i saw on vinted uh that needs to go to paris and just enjoying the outside for a while before i go back home i need to vacuum or i would like to vacuum and i really want to just edit that video that i filmed and posted it's not going to be anything fancy it's just me talking and expressing myself i almost don't want to post it and that's because i now feel all totally fine and feel really good but i think i still need to post it just so i can like out myself and have that as a memory to look back on in the next two years because in the next two years a lot of things are going to change i think it's it's a good thing to do it's a very nice sunday tomorrow i have an appointment at 10 to go do my nails my nails are redonkulous again i'm loving this kind of nail i think this is going to be my standard go-to but i promised myself that i wanted to do red nails next or like a red orange nail next and then green like a bright green and then i think i'm going to go back to this kind of nail and tomorrow i have a whole day planned as well so stay up to date to do my 23 and me test i got it on 50 percent off a few days ago and i thought let me do it today i liked it well i'll explain all about it in another video when i get the results back like a quick introduction before actually seeing what my results are but yeah let's go and do the test if you want to see my results and all that kind of stuff just subscribe to my channel and i'll share them once i have them and then you'll know more about what this test actually is you're not supposed to drink or eat food 30 minutes before doing a test i haven't had anything since yesterday because i'm doing it with morning spit so i'm trying to make myself spit shouldn't be touching it but okay um yeah it's enough press firmly until you hear it click the liquid and the lid will be released into the tube to mix with the saliva make sure that the lid is closed tightly can i get no more tight than that continue holding the tube upright unscrew the funnel from the tube and discard and discard um use the cap to seal the tube 
and then I'm like a little kid <laughs> and then shake the two for five seconds I'm excited if you know me well you know one reason why I was inclined to this company you can see it no words needed <laughs> but okay we did it we did it we did it we did it hooray gonna get my nails done I love this kind of nail or style but I'm gonna do them short and do it red because that's what I had in mind so I went with this color and I'm not really loving it mm. to be honest I am not loving it I miss my nails that I had just with like the white tip that feels a bit more like me and this feels much and nice but oh I'm not loving it I think I found what my nails should be but I still want to try green after this so I don't know maybe I just need to try it get out of my system and then back to like what I like and what I know so I just had an interview for a company that is so amazing <laughs> and this is my setup I just wanted to show you so I have my ring light here um, and I turned my dining table and I have my laptop on top of all of these magazines camera well not camera laptop glass of water that i didn't drink and then all my notes that i made from i have my notes here of like literally all that i went all that i went through all of my notes that i made and highlighting because you know i'm the queen of highlighting here i wrote down some things about me that i can remember because sometimes you're talking about yourself and you just forget what you can do like i'm driven enthusiastic attentive disciplined authentic inquisitive ambitious adaptable time management skills I have, getting energized when collaborating with others, la 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 la. And then just some things I write here. And I'm not minding my nails now, like, okay, let me just love them. And then here's all other interviews that I've had and also some questions I wrote for like when having interviews that I told myself to ask. So like one of them was, what is your favorite part of the job? And yeah, and this is how I look. This is what I'm wearing. My white pants, red belt, red orange belt. This blouse I wore for my birthday. My hair like this. Also having an interview with braids in, I feel like a bit much. I feel a bit much. I feel like I should have my natural hair just in a low ponytail behind and not be much. Do, you, do any of you have that like my Dark skin girls, color girls, do y'all feel like that also when having interviews? Because I feel like I need to just like calm myself down, but I tell myself, no, I need to just be me. Like I am a vibrant being. I like being vibrant. I am me. So if they don't like me when they see me, then yeah. And I'm so thankful that I'm having these interviews now a bit more like bi-weekly, weekly, because it's really helping me, even though in my last video, if you didn't watch it, it was after I got the news from hearing from a company that I thought would have been the best fit for me, that I didn't get the job. But now I'm just thinking like, no, I really want to move forward. I'm not going to stop and I'm not stopping. I'm going to get a job that's creative, that is hands-on, that is innovative, that is wow, because that's what I want to do. I want to give back to a company to help them better themselves and also to, it's kind of like me validating myself. I feel like working with a company that's so huge as even the one I interviewed with today as well, because this too is a very big company. And for the two ladies I interviewed with, I hope you're doing well. I hope you like my energy. I know that I can like sometime, but I, I'm, I'm excited. And I feel good. I feel proud of myself compared to my last video that I filmed where I just was very hurt and very feeling. I was in my feelings. 
But now, your girl's shining and your girl's feeling good and I'm putting my head, I have in my head that I'm not gonna stop. That is not gonna stop me. My dream job, what I thought was my dream job, didn't happen, but I most probably was being protected for something that I didn't need to go into. So I'm letting it go and we're gonna see where I end up. I'm gonna continue doing my content. I'm gonna get my YouTube channel monetized this year and go. <laughs> I'm gassing myself now, like gas, like throwing sugar all over me. I'm gonna pack up now because I'm going to leave the house to go to The Hague to meet with another creative and I'm co-creating again today. Look at me, co-creating in May. Well, Saturday wasn't me, but like co-creating a lot. So yeah, I'm gonna go now by her or pack my stuff up and go by her and co-create so yeah let's go i'm gonna take you with me and we're gonna meet her or you're gonna meet her you're gonna be introduced to her <laughs> let's go <laughs> <laughs> So say hi, introduce yourself. Hi, my name is Minerva. Minerva, yes. she is a bekende Nederlander. You, you, sure. <laughs> Let's go with that. Yeah. BNR, she has a lot of views. She's known in the natural hair community, very, very big. She travels globally. And well, has... speaking into existence, I know you. <laughs> okay. And has a booming business. And we're now in her studio. Thank you for that. Mm -hmm. I am in awe of Sujin. I am in <laughs> awe. Look at her planner. It's like she's so organized. Look at my planner. Oh, yeah, we were we're just comparing, we're comparing planners. planners. And I'm just like looking at what she has to do for the month. You no, know, we have a packed schedule. <laughs> There's a lot going on. Busy, busy, busy. It's written in hidden ink. You know, invisible ink. Invisible um, ink. You know what? Let me do a vlog exception. Let me bring the people in as well. Uh -huh. It's geweldig. She is so organized. This is the face of organization. Okay. <laughs> we are gonna for get me, a life together. For me, it's so normal. I, I I was just telling her like, for me, this is normal. And when I see people talking like, oh my god, you're so organized. But it's like, oh my gosh, she is so organized. Oh. Let me just say this. When you see me running around in these streets and I'm organized, I got my life together. I'm a content queen, queen of consistency, all of that good stuff. Just know it's her. It's rubbing off on you. It's just like rub off on me. Please <laughs> rub me. I have a lot to learn. It's not to learn. It's just to do. But in my defense, my phone has some of the things that I'm supposed to do. Yes, and you have a lot. You see? I mean... Just write it down. Mm, look at mm -hmm. that. It's barbecue pork. Mm -hmm. it's, uh, mm -hmm. it's, like, it was a lot of meat. <laughs> I like it though. The pork is really good. I was very surprised actually. Flavorful. And I have some sushi. Yes. Sushi. Yeah, but that looks so good now. I'm a little jealous. <laughs> good night to me. I love myself so much. I mean the world to me. Exactly that. That's my new favorite TikTok. Good night to me. I mean the world to me. <laughs> I'm back home. I had three days off the last few days that I took you along my journey and showed you what I was up to. But now I'm home. Today's Monday and I work tomorrow from the office and I only work four days this week Tuesday Wednesday Thursday Friday and have a good weekend planned this weekend as well so I will see you back with a new vlog that will start on Thursday this week yeah so if you enjoyed this video go ahead and give the video a like subscribe if you haven't already Go ahead and subscribe to my channel and I'll see you in my next one.
Bye. Good night to me.